What's up everybody, today I'm gonna show you guys everything that's new with the mod menu in Gang Beasts. You're gonna need a keyboard and a mouse, and unfortunately for Xbox users, this only works for PC and PlayStation. Behind me you can see all the different items you can spawn in, and above it you can see a number. That's the number on your keyboard you're gonna have to press to spawn it. There is a small ball, a bigger ball, a cardboard box, a dumpster, and lastly a bone loaf. Now, these items have been in the game for years now. But after the new update you can actually spawn these little guys and these not so little guys and they work the same way that they do in waves and the strong guys are still very strong. There's actually no limit on how many you can spawn in so you can just make a horde like this and just perform a stage dive like I just did. You can have a ton of fun with them because you can literally spawn hundreds of them. I mean this looks like I reached level 100 in waves. Wherever you have your mouse cursor is where the item is going to spawn, or the effect is going to be applied. If you press 1 on your keyboard, it's going to do the effect from vents, where you're gonna get pushed down. If you press 2, however, you're going to fly, and you can fly pretty high if you just keep spamming 2. By pressing 8 on your keyboard, you will spawn in confetti. You know that confetti that comes when you win the game? Unfortunately, you can't spam it like you used to be able to, but it's still cool. I'm gonna show you a few fun things you can do with the mod menu. For example, make it cast a lot of these boxes and play around in it. Or you can spawn in a dumpster, open it, and then play basketball. If you can really call that basketball. Whatever. You can also close the dumpster and hide inside of it. If you can just give me one second. God, it's a little bit hard. There you go. That's cool, right? You can make a ball pit and ring, and you can play around in it with your friends. Except I don't have any. But maybe you guys do. You can derail the train if you place dumpsters in front of it. Look, just look at this. This looks like a goddamn Mission Impossible movie. Goddamn. You can see how many dumpsters it would take to sink the trawler. I, I kind of lost count. One of my favorites is to spawn dumpsters in front of trucks. And I can assure you, you will get a pretty bumpy ride. But it's fun. It's really, really fun. It's like... Probably the most fun. Spawning items on the hamburgers on wheel can give you some interesting results. You can also test how durable the elevators are by dropping heavy dumpsters on top of it. It looks like it can hold quite a few. Thank you so much for watching everyone. I hope you have fun using this mod menu. I don't even know what to call it. I just ended up calling it mod menu, but that's not the point. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Ciao.